Hey guys, a little video, something a bit different for you now. This one is on obviously the Bofang, Bofong, whatever, uh, UV5R. Uh, this particular radio, uh, I got it from a friend of mine. Uh, and the VFO button here does nothing. AB works fine. Every other button works, but the VFO button here does absolutely nothing. So, I'm going to pull apart this here radio and uh, see if we can't figure out what's on go with this switch or possibly even replace it. I got a, I got some micro switches there. If it's that tight switch, I'm not sure, but I'm not going to know until I get it apart. But, um, if you're interested in possibly uh, following along and see if, we can, if I can possibly repair this switch, uh, stay by, stand by. We'll, uh, I'll have a go at her. Possibly either it'll work or it won't work, but uh, yeah. I'm not going to know if we don't try. So, yeah. Anyway. Bofang, UV, fiber, VFO switch is dud. Let's fix it. Okay, well, I'm going to undo the antennae. Then we're going to remove the battery by pushing in on the little black clip here. Slide the battery off. And the battery, uh, if you're curious, is a lithium ion battery, 1800 milliamp hours. The model BL 5, voltage 7.4 volts. You specified Bofang charger only. The damage or placed in the fire might explode. Do not short circuit. Do not disassemble. The damage or placed <laughs> in fire. Okay. Don't put it in a fire. No worries. No worries. I won't. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, take off the belt clip. I've never pulled apart a uh, UV5R before. I don't know if it's fit deep or what. But we're going to uh, have a go at it. Book clips removed. I'm assuming the knob just pulls straight out on these, maybe? Yes, they do. Oh, of course, we got two little rings in here. they got to come off. I thought it was fun. Do I got something that can do that now is the question. Ah, there you go. That one's moving. Moving, moving, moving. Do -do 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 -do. That one. That nut is off. Let's see if we can't move this nut. Good luck and God bless, is he? Let me little needle those pliers. See if he'll move it. There you go. He move. Oh, if anybody is watching uh, my video here, um, that worked with me when I was with uh, Rudder. Works to work with rudder. You might remember me needing those pliers. I still got them. <laughs> After all these years. Alright, so what are we into here? So, oh, we got torques. We have one torque, two torques, three torques, four. Now, question is, do I have a torque bit in my little screwdriver bits there? Please stand by, we'll see if I can dig one out. Alright, I'm going to use my China tools to work on a China radio. <laughs> Why not? Okay, clip. Spring. Spring stays on there, that's good. There's the battery release. Get that screw out. Get that screw out. Now, 
So, let's see. This thing just kind of come up. I guess. I don't know. Looks like it comes up. Come up and slide out, maybe. A lot of commercial stuff does that. Slide it off the bottom, and there's no more screws in this. I don't see any more screws. Look at this a bit further. Hmm. Buttons all comes loose. All that comes loose. Does she come out from the bottom or what? Well, she must push out from here. No, I never broke any. Just slipped as well. Is there another hidden screw? I think there's one right there. Something right there. Right there. Looks like there's something right there. Yep. Hidden screw. Hidden something. Is it a screw? Is it definitely an indention there? There was definitely a dent there. No <coughs> screw there. Oh, it still feels like there's something there though. It was filled in. There was, def there was definitely might have been a hole here at one time. Anyway, can you want? She don't want to let go, does she? Indeed, she's a deep fit. She is a tight fit. I saw it. We'll come off the side here, won't. Here got to come out, maybe. That was holding it all. Possibly. Yeah. 
I don't think so. She won't, she won't release past that. Boy, she must come straight up. She got to. She's got to. What the fucking hole in it? Pardon me, French. What is hole in this, boys? Whenever we get in summer. And we're in. Well, that wasn't fun, now was it? There's your speaker. All your buttons. Connect the speaker wires. Can throw that aside. Take that off. All right. Keep me galoshes on here so I can see where I'm at. So I'm getting both. The older I'm getting, man, the more blind I'm getting. Anyway. Well, I guess the button's not going to be replaced too easy. Because then it's, uh... built into the board. <laughs> Could be a problem. That could definitely be a problem. Well, I need a way to figure out. To uh, get it to switch. <coughs> Let's see. Give it a flying flashing screwdriver here. Let's see if we can get this plastic sticker kind of. Up off the board. So we're gonna run a test here. Can it be moved or not? Is it all one thing? Nope. Get that edge piece there. Okay. Oh, it just needs to be clean by the looks of it. Eraser idea before and it worked. Use the pencil eraser around the 
circuit boards before, scanners, that had uh, filthy connections. here goes right over it and uh, shorts it all out when you press it so I'll put that back down again give it a whirl give it a whirl see what happens <laughs> All right, let's get the battery on that maybe, possibly. Is it working? Need a bit of a clean. Geez, those LEDs some bright, aren't they? Still got a press a nice bit on it though. Fresh right down on but it is switching. Right. See if we can't piece this thing back together again. <laughs> oh boy, <clears throat> anything we can look at while we're in here. Uh, she was made in 2021. According to that date code, 210804. She's either made in 2021 or I'm gonna say made in 2021. Year, month, day. Not a whole lot to see here. Put her together and show it out. Speaker wires are put on. Feelings on. So. She is a tight, and I mean tight squeeze. Screw it back in.
Don't worry about the little strip thing for the wrist strap. I don't give a shit about that. Is it? I was, uh, what the fuck? How the hell is this thing going up? Clip back on. It'll obviously, be easier with the battery off, but you know, they do it the hard way. <laughs> Still got a precinct on it, <clears throat> but it's working more than it did before. Anyway, that's how you.
kind of repair the VFO button on the UV fiber. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the video. <laughs> Renox 63, we're out of here. Thank you.